my new rodeo coach's office and um, he was getting a call um, from DJ Downs about, you know, doing the Pistol Pete gig and riding into the stadium. And, um, you know, he, he didn't want to do it. So eventually it came to me and I, you know, talked to DJ, I met up with him in a half hour. And uh, needless to say, it's been history ever since 2015, 2016, yeah, that I had gotten the, the gig to do Pistol Pete. And that was um, really just my start. Um, didn't know if I was gonna come back and do it the next year. Um, and I ended up getting a call or it uh, was a text message from Chet saying, hey, we, you know, are we gonna be able to do this again? I was like, yeah, I was like, I'll do it as long as you guys need me to do it. And as long as I live in the county, um, I'm more than happy to do all these ride-ins. Um, DJ immediately was like the white horse and all the gals were like the white horse we want we want the white horse and I was like okay so it was an easy pick between uh, between what horse everybody wanted he, he took the star star of the show moment just because of his color I think being white it just looks flashy and it looks great it's, it's been nice to be able to pull into the stadium and, and uh, before it wasn't like that and it's it's really really cool to see how it's kind of morphed into actually this uh, this thing people know Pistol Pete and the horse and, uh, people are really starting to know Keystone I volunteer all my time um, when I do this uh, to New Mexico State University just because I want to give back to the state that I uh, you know that that's given me so much and honestly it's a it's really cool to go out there and kind of have the the, the wholesome cowboy spirit that Pistol Pete should have. For a long time, Pistol Pete was just, you know, a mascot. Really feel like uh, this position that, you know, you know, running into the stadium and, you know, having the horse be, you know, authentic and, you know, really in spirit the school and uh, tie in what we're really about at New Mexico State University really, uh, it really makes me excited to do it year after year and honestly why I grow out the giant mustache that I wear for several months out of the season and you know it, it's it's something that I take a lot of pride in I don't know I, I changed my entire look of myself to embody what the school is about I feel like giving that back to the, the fans because they have an authentic presence for the school and something that they can come back time and time again and see you know the same person and you know cling to that figure is uh it's really important. I think it's changed the way New Mexico State football has been looked at as well.